This is Ponder Darling, my busted heart, and um, here I am again in no makeup, and <laughs> um, I'm going to be honest, when I, I have made videos where I look great, and, um, and I, I think that there was a part of me always that was like, um, that I wanted to look really good, um, just in case Jefferson ever saw my video. <laughs> which is ridiculous like he doesn't he, he doesn't give a shit about me but um also like what what would it matter if I wore makeup or not like it didn't really matter you know I god I did so much to try to be attractive to him and it never worked so I got to the point where I was like that cannot be the reason why I put makeup on and make myself look good for a video so I'm just gonna be real I'm gonna be real and I'm gonna be humble and humility real humility which narcissists lack is about saying you know I'm no better or no worse than anybody else I'm just me narcissists cannot say that they can't have that. So, um, I wanted to, speaking of being no better and no worse than anybody else, and that's why I kind of segue. Um, I've read a lot of um, comments, various comments, you know, some of them are like, oh, narcissists are demon possessed, they're possessed by the devil, they're sent you know, there's, they're sent by evil forces or, um, or even like on the other end, I've talked about this in another video, like they come to teach you this lesson and they, sh they show you your deepest wounds so you can heal them. Okay. Narcissists are not magical beings. They're just people. They're douchebags is what they are. They're just very, very flawed human beings. They're not fa these, you know, demigods who, you know, I mean, you can feel that way because they, they know how to, you know, kind of hypnotize you. Um, but th they're not, they're just normal run of the mill people. You know, they're like a magician that does a magic trick. They're not, th those magic tricks are not real. They're not real magical things that nobody else can do. They're tricks. They're magical tricks. <laughs> but it's not real magic. It's not a real, you know, like magic, like mi miraculous magic. They're not miraculous beings. Jefferson used to say, I've, I've got my, I've got my angel wings and I'm going to wrap them around you, you know, like alluding to the fact that he was this, this incredible magical being. You know what? Jefferson is just a guy, an unemployed guy who sits in a broken chair in the living room of the house where he grew up because he's too afraid to act like a grown ass man and he plays video games all day and he lives off his disabled brother. That's the truth. That's not a magical being. He's not a magical being. He's, he's a loser. So, you know, don't put, especially if you've been discarded, don't put that idiot on a, on a pedestal, you know, deconstruct him. You know, find his flaws, figure out, you know, the truth about him, that he's really not, he's not, he's, he's nothing special. You thought he was something special because he did a magic trick that you believed. But, you know, if you, the whole reason why there's so many, you know, narcissist information channels on the on YouTube and narcissist blogs and and books and stuff like that is yes it is very very confusing it's very very confusing when you encounter one of these people they they deliberately try to confuse you that's what they're doing they're trying to confuse you it's like look over here while I do this 
um, magic thing over here that you're not going to see because I'm, you know, doing this over here. I mean, that's, you know, it, it, but it's not, it's not like this supernatural thing. It's, it's just a bunch of bullshit. So, you know, one, you, it's really, really important in your healing journey to realize that this person was not some powerful being. They are just, they're actually, you know, in reality, they're, they have no power at all. They're, they have, they're very, they have, they have a huge deficit. You know, they have no set, they, they don't, they don't know how to be moral. And like I said in, a, in another video, they know right from wrong. So they know they're, they're bad. And so all these little tricks that they do are to try to, they're, they're hypnotizing you, but they're also trying to hypnotize themselves into believing that they're good people, that they're worthwhile, that they have value. Because deep down inside, they know that they don't. They, they, they catch glimpses of their own darkness and it freaks them the fuck out. And that's why they have all these like very elaborate little schemes and magic tricks and, and they, you know, they prey on other people to get, you know, supply because they can't, it, it can't generate it from themselves. They can't generate a feeling of self-worth from inside of themselves. So it, there is, there's no reason to think of them as these magical supernatural beings. They're just not. They're not. So I'm going to give you a little tip that my best friend and I used to do when we were in junior high and we liked this boy and he ended up being a jerk. We would like, we would tear them down. We would, we would draw these caricatures of them and we would just be merciless. We draw these little pictures of them, you know, just, just completely exaggerating their flaws. And, um, and then we would, you know, we would make fun of them. That's what you got to do with your narcissist. That's what you got to do. Make fun of him. That's the only way to win with them. You, you know, you want to talk about how to, how to overcome a narcissist, how to take revenge on a narcissist, how to win with a narcissist. That's how you win. You knock them off their freaking pedestal and you stop thinking that they're this magical being that has power over you. They have no power over you. They're losers. I don't care if, if you know, the narcissist who fucked you over was a, was a millionaire. He's a loser. Good people are the kind of people who are not losers. Good people who actually have a moral code that they live by and are kind to other people. Those are the kind of people that we should put on a pedestal. Not narcissists that do stupid bullshit. And I know that, you know, our, our whole country puts narcissists on a pedestal. We voted for one. We have one in, in power right now. You know, we, we, we have this, we, the whole, our whole country idolizes narcissists. So I understand why you would feel that way, but stop, just stop. He's a loser. He's an idiot. Or she is a loser. She's an idiot. <laughs> you know, there are female narcissists running around there being assholes, just like men. So, you know, it's really important. You know, humility is important. Yeah, don't, don't let them make you feel like they're better than you because they're not. They're not. You're not better than them either. We're, you know, God loves us all. So that's what I had to say. Thanks.